Hello all and welcome back to the Spruce Gate Modeling. Today we will be looking at a paint up some crews for those American paratrooper heavy weapons. So we will be focusing on the 75mm gun crew. Um, and the first step is a really simple base coat with US uh, dark green. So yeah, this covers everything. He could be more detailed if you want. It's a little easier this way and doesn't make a difference. So. Next is also very simple, an all-around pretty heavy black wash. Uh, this will just darken this color a bit and allow us to do this step, which is a quick highlight with the base color. Um, we're just going to dry brush that on. Next, we will be starting on the webbing with a base coat of U.S. Field Drab. I know this seems a little dark for webbing, but it works. We're going to add some highlights later. It'll look really nice. All right, there we go. So next we'll be taking a drop of pale sand and we'll be adding it to our U.S. Field Drab for that nice highlight. So this is just a pretty fine or um, heavy, depending on, you know, what, what kind of look you're going for, uh, highlight on webbing. So next we'll be taking flat brown and we'll be painting um, leather bits. So leather is basically boots, helmet straps, and pistol holsters. So there we are with that. Next, we will be taking uh, some khaki and we will be painting the scrim camo on the helmet. Uh, next, we'll be taking some medium flesh tone and base coating the flesh. We'll then give that a highlight of barbarian flesh. Now I'll be taking olive brown and base coating the wood. Normally, you would have both rifle wood and the shovel handles, but we only have shovel handles because this is a gun crew. Now I'll be taking brass, another purely gun crew thing, and we'll be base coating all of the shells. So, there we are with brass. Now we will be taking some um, black and we'll be base coating the front of the shells, uh, you know, the actual shell part, not the shell casing. Um, so, now we'll be taking some uh, German pale brown and we'll be highlighting the shovel handles. Um, again, normally you would also be doing rifle wood with this, but yeah. Now we'll be taking our final wash of sh really thin down strong tone and we will be going over all of the figures. Thank you so much for watching. I'm sorry it took me this long to get out. Um, I've been painting the whole army, so yeah, thank you.